Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video we're going to be taking a look at the Discipline 65. This is a fully customizable DIY mechanical keyboard with alpaca switches. So without further ado let's go ahead and get into the build and talk about why this is now one of my favorite boards. Well guys, as you can see, the Discipline 65 is a pretty good project if I do say so for myself. Uh, as you can see, each diode that is soldered in, you have to manually uh, place it in there and solder it in through the holes. Uh, then you have the two switches, uh, and then you have your ground connector, your fuse, USB-C, which was probably the harder part simply because you had to make sure you use flux, and I had to use the microscopic camera to make sure none of the connections were shorted out. Luckily, no issues there. Then we have the capacitor, the LED, and the resistors. And next to that is the brains of the system, the Atmega32, and the crystals that are underneath of that. After we installed all of those little devices, we installed the switches onto the palm plate. After installing all the switches onto the palm plate with the PCB at the bottom of it, we flipped it over and soldered each switch individually. And then we mounted all of that into this nice little acrylic case. Now this particular Discipline 65 is different from a lot of the others you may have seen. The other one that you may have seen in the other videos is mounted onto this plate 
like this one here. However, I chose to go the case option simply for the aesthetics as well as the sound and quality build look. One of the best things and my favorite thing about this is the way in which all of the electronics are on display. You'll notice that on other PCBs, such as this one, all of the diodes are placed pretty much next to the switches. However, this one reroutes all of those diodes up top so you can see all those cool little devices there. Overall, I think it's a really cool look and it's really, really nice sounding as well as looking and I really, really appreciate this build. There are a few of these still open and I'll definitely put a link in the description below to possibly join in on those. This one in particular, uh, was about $170. However, if you just get the plate mounted version such as this one, it's only about $70. So it's also a good budget keyboard option. I highly recommend it for learning and having a nice aesthetic. I definitely recommend checking out this custom Discipline 65 keyboard kit. Feel free to let me know what you guys think about this one in the comments below guys. As always, stay awesome and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.